Hello Pelican watching fans, I'm Kevin Ripa and this is my Sands 3 Minutes Max. Uh, as many of you have probably seen on the news lately, uh, the uh, perpetrators of the Twitter hack got caught. Now, we know being in digital forensics incident response field, uh, the, the proliferation of the InfoSec field, that clearly there's a big market in trying to investigate things because a lot of bad things happen. Why do so many bad things happen online? Well, they happen online because that's the safest place to do it. In the vast majority of cases, the, the big intrusions, nobody gets caught. Why? Because we can't figure out who did it. In order for someone to get caught, there has to be some trackability. In this Twitter hack, uh, the reason that the people were found was because they made mistakes. And whatever their activity was, got tracked back to them. They would have never got caught if it wasn't tracked back to them. And even if it was tracked back to them, if it turned out that they were all somewhere in Redactistan, well, you still couldn't have gotten to them. It's one thing to know exactly who did it. It's entirely another to be able to put your hands on them. All of that to say this is what is wrong with the internet today. The internet has turned into this three coil steaming cesspool of a place where people hang out and opinions can be shot out in, in nanoseconds. Whether or not you would ever say these to someone's face, and you probably wouldn't, you can hop online and say whatever you want. You can hack computers with virtual impunity if you know how. And so, we have to look at how did it get that way and what can we do to fix it? Because at the end of the day, we're going to have to fix it. We can't allow it to continue going on the way it is. Ransomware and hacks and the proliferation of malware. Uh, my gosh, even spam. We have to find a better way to do things. And we can't allow the system that we've created to be the very thing that hampers us in finding the bad people. So in the next two episodes, I'm going to float a really, really ridiculous notion. I'm going to talk in the first episode, the next one, about what we can do to fix this. And in the episode after that, how we can go about paying for it. I'm warning you now, it's radical, it's crazy, it's out there, but who knows? It just might work. So in the meantime and in between time, that's it. Another episode of 3 Minutes Max.